All right, since the crowd started to get rowdy first, let's fire some shots in here. A little bit of buckshot never hurt anyone. Well, actually, I, I guess it did. Hello, everybody. Great show, please. We're back with more riot civil unrest. So you guys wanted me to go full violent. <laughs> I saw the comments. Everyone wants live ammunition and no survivors. YouTube demonetization train. Go! But that's fine. We're going to go ahead and do it. There's a few things I found out as well. Let's continue onward with Karatea. I kind of want to unlock this all the way. We're on the ballot over here. So something that I found out, we're going to use the police because I think that's where some good amounts of violence can come from. Something I found out, a lot of people are having trouble with the difficulty level of this game. And some of it is just like being unable to select things, which I totally get and can be a real pain in the ass. But one of the things that you can do in this game is watch your budget and you get less rioters if you can keep your budget down. Which is something that I didn't do and a lot of people don't do. They just like, they outfit their guys with as much armor and weapons as humanly possible. And then the amount of rioters that they have to deal with is through the friggin' roof. So here, watch this real quick. So we start with 61 people. But if we remove some gas masks and a little bit of, uh, a little bit of armor over here. Goes down to 56. We can do this with everyone. And you can get your numbers way down this way. Now it's down to 52. And from what I've seen, like, numbers in this game, in other words, like, the people that you're up against, is far more important than the gear that you have. Meaning that if you can get this number down, you can, you can deal with very low amounts of gear. But, you're gonna notice one of the things that doesn't cost anything is your extra item over here. So, like, I can put a radio on here, and I still have the exact same amount of people that we're gonna have to deal with. And we're definitely gonna want some radios. The radios are really good, and we can buy more people, which is really cool. So, let's go some radios. Uh, we're gonna want... We're gonna want some grenades. I like the smoke bomb more than the stun grenade. I just feel it's a little bit better. All these extras don't cost anything, by the way. Uh, oh! And we're not going for smoke grenade launchers. You boys know it. Now, there's a lot of extra points by going for live ammo, but we're just gonna have to deal with it. Live ammo or buckshot? Oh, wow, the buckshot is, like... Way cheaper than the live ammo. That's interesting. This is still live ammo, isn't it? It's freaking buckshot. This isn't like some sort of non-lethal weapon. I think it says like rubber ammo. Yeah, there's rubber ammo for the non-lethal stuff. We're doing buckshot, baby. Oh, yeah. That's what I'm talking about. Smoke bomb, buckshot. What should we have over here? Let's do another ballistic. And we get five members if we do tactical. But look at the price difference. Wow. It's okay, though. I think, I think I'd rather do, like, one more tack unit. So let's do one more tack unit. Now, you're going to see the amount of people are going to go way up over here. Let's go ahead and outfit these guys light. Yep, very good. Let's put... Uh, let's give this guy live ammo. So, again, I don't know if the live ammo is going to cause all kinds of... We're already up to 81 people. So you can see how quickly the number of people goes up. Uh, the baton, that's fine. And I'm going to do, like, one more radio. Just because having several radios on the group is probably going to be pretty important over here. So there we go, boys. Live ammo, a little bit of buckshot, and then a bunch of batons. You could get, like, slightly cheaper batons, I think. Uh, what is this? Like, 321? How low can we get it? 315, I guess. Uh, let's see. If we do that... Let me see what happens if I change... It's just a wooden stick. Yeah, we're not really getting it down that far. All right. So this is what we're going to go roll with. We're going to have to deal with 81 people. Let's freaking do this. Now, I've never played this board before. A riot is the language of the unheard. I'll bet it is. Let us watch our cutscene. As my alarm goes off in the morning, as it normally does, a young man wakes up. Is that a naked woman? <laughs> At least it's heavily pixelated, so YouTube's not going to be able to screw me over. Flag waving overhead. As men of uniform pile out of their armored vehicle, putting their helmets on, and sluggishly roll on in to their post. Greetings, men, says the commander, as he stands there. Day after day. <laughs> oh, this is terrible. A couple of bugs just kind of wandering around over what looks like a refuse pile. Commander goes to take a leak. Starts to rain. That's unfortunate. And... Oh, crap. He's suddenly surrounded by men with beady sticks. But all of a sudden, the police fight back. In they roll. Not prepared. What happened over here? Oh, my God. All right. Let's start. Holy crap. I'm going to start rolling everyone on angry right now. 
Is this an armored vehicle we have? Hold on. Can I select this? Oh, yeah. Roll in, armored vehicle. Roll in. There we go. All right, we got to get our police over here like, like freaking stat. Uh, who has a police radio? Everyone roll in. Everyone roll in. And everyone turn into ho full hostilities. Full hostilities. We want no survivors right now. The boys wanted to see full hostility, so we're doing it. More police radios. Let's make sure that we get everyone in here. All right, since the crowd started to get rowdy first, let's fire some shots in here. A little bit of buckshot never hurt anyone. Well, actually, I, I guess it did. Come on, police. Push in. Push in. You can see our line goes down every once in a while. Now, what does this have? Is that a, a, a water cannon? <laughs> yes. Oh, that's awesome. Got a friggin' water hydrant. There we go. Yeah, hose everyone down. Look at these guys rolling up. You think you're gonna roll up on us? Not today, sucker. Oh, 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 oh. Police are starting to uh, head on out over here. Let's go ahead and put down some... Uh, go ahead and put down some stuff over here. You guys get up over here. A little bit more buckshot, I think. Should quell this riot. You see the blood spray out over there? Oh my god, this game. Come on, boys. Come on, boys. Everyone get in over here. Don't get all scared now. Enter the te testudo mode. The, the armored turtle mode over here now. Continue to hose everyone down with the fire hydrant. I don't have time for your guys' crap. Live ammo. Fire the live ammo into the crowd. Yes. Again. YouTube, it's only a game. I swear to you. <laughs> oh, oh, don't. No, whoa, 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 whoa. Don't get, don't get ahead of yourselves now, man. Don't get ahead of yourselves now. A couple of smoke bombs will teach these guys what time it is. Throw them on in there. A couple of smoke bombs. There we go. Yes. Keep a nice long distance between us and the crowd. There we go. Let's enter our armored mode again. A little bit more live ammunition for scumbags that want to roll up in here. What is this guy? Look at this guy over here. Look at this guy rolling up. You know what? Let's do some arrests. Do some friggin' arrests. You boys want to pull this crap on me? Wrong. Everyone gets beady sticked and everyone gets arresticated. Now, arrests are good for thinning out the crowd, which is pretty sweet. So, they're, it's pretty good to do it every once in a while. We'll do a smoke bomb right down here just to clear this little area out. You can see I'm starting to, like, move way in over here. All right, Fire Hydrant Mobile. How you doing over here? Pretty good. There's one guy just sitting there with his back to us, not really doing too much. So, we'll just kind of leave him over there. Oh. Gotta move our police back in. You can see the police, it's like it's like herding freaking cats over here, man. More smoke bombs. Lay those smoke bombs in nice and thick, man. Come on, boys. Get up in here. What are you guys, what are you guys doing? You guys hanging out down there? Oh, there's someone who's not fully violent. I want full violence now. Grab the radio. Rally the troops. Yeah, see this? Look, every once in a while, guys go right off the friggin' map. That's not what we want. We want to push that way over there. We got a couple guys in defensive mode. I feel like I should change that. There we go. That's more like it. Let's do some arrests. More arrests over here. More arrests. Fire some freaking live ammo into the crowd too. There we go. That's good. That's good. You know what? We're going to... Uh, I'm going to do it. You ready? You ready for this? Charge! Charge the van! <laughs> Oh my god, people just get freaking rammed by the van. Oh, I just took out one of my own police officers. I'm sorry, man. Oh, I'm so sorry about that. Oh, 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 we are getting, hold on here. Uh, where's there a radio? There we go. Grab the radio. We need to get all the police back in here. It looks like the timing resets. As long as we can get the police up in here. More armor mode. There we go. More live ammo. Fire on these guys over here. Look at these guys over here. Hold on. Let's roll up this way. These guys are just looming around. Bull crap. Fire. Fire your ammo. Fire. There we go. Push that crowd way the hell back. That's what I like to see. That's, that's what the angry mob likes to see. Keep moving our police over here. There we go. Yeah, we're doing it. We're causing a lot of friggin' havoc, man. We are, uh, we are violent as all hell. Move these guys, move these guys on full violence as well. Go into the, uh, full defensive formation, y'all. See a couple of rocks coming in here. I'm not a big fan about that. I don't like it when rocks get thrown, so we're gonna have to, uh, 
What should I do? Just a smoke bomb, I think. A nice smoke bomb will be nice. There we go. Sure you'll all enjoy that. And, uh, yeah, maybe a couple of shots over here just to move this group back. No big deal. No big deal. Be another couple of shots over here in just a moment. Yeah, I think we've got it, man. Bring, uh, bring this over here. Move everyone in. Let's go ahead and take our, our fire hydrant and hose some people down. And then, uh, maybe we'll do a little charge. A little cavalry charge in here. Charge! Raw! There we go. Oh, yeah. We got it down. Again, going hyper-violent definitely works. It's probably not the best way to deal with the situation, but it definitely works. Another couple of uh, grenades over here. And, uh, yeah, let's, uh, let's do some arrests if we can as well. This guy over here looks like he's being too protesty. Go ahead and beat the living crap out of him. And then bring him over into our... I don't know what we have. Maybe like a maybe like an armored van or something like that where we hold people. Let's go ahead and do some more arrests. There's, some, there's a guy like right over here just kind of looming around. It's weird how every once in a while you can't click. Like sometimes I notice you can't click on anything. There's really nothing you can do about it. All right. Well, I think we did pretty damn good for the most part. Oh, what's this? Come on, boys. Get back in, get back in here. We got, we got like 10 seconds left that we have to hold this. And that's pretty much it. A little bit more live ammo. There we go. A couple more shots just for the hell of it. Two seconds, one second, and we are victorious. I imagine that we're going to have a huge disadvantage because we were violent as hell. Now, to be fair, they were throwing a couple, like, rocks and stuff at us. But we were, oh, my God. 21 rebels friggin' injured. There's a ton of property damage on their side, though. The police, oh, my God. The police defended their position. They executed violent attacks. We sure did. We didn't kill anyone. Oh, we killed one person. We killed one person. Uh, we got 21 wounded policemen? Holy crap. So, they were actually a lot more violent than us. The rioters committed heavy acts of violence. And we're going to have the advantage next time. Wow. Okay. Well, I guess violence is the key. What does the newspaper have to say about this? Violent riots cause a tragic death. Police forces resist. Look at this over here. A group of 130 protesters attempted to send away 20 police officers this afternoon at 1547 in Grace without any success. Stephen Hayes, an activist, passed away while protesting in the riot. He died at the age of 35, but it seems like his passing won't be forgotten. Many are praying for him and hoping that his loss didn't happen in vain. Others fear this might affect the current delicate and unstable situation. Yeah, no crap. We've unlocked Lafin. We unlock anything else? Ooh, long range smoke grenade launcher. A new one, I guess. And here we go, baby. So now uh, they have us set up with all units, two ballistic units, two assault units, three assault units, and one tactical unit. Let's go ahead and outfit our guys as best we can. Again, the smoke grenade launcher, you guys want death and destruction. So what else do I have over here that I could use? The pepper spray just isn't good enough. Sniper rifles. Right over here. M25 sniper rifles. Let's friggin' load them out. All right, boys. Batons, sniper rifles, freaking light gear on everyone. And I think I got like one gas mask on everyone. So we're gonna be doing 89 people, full violence. Let's freaking do it. What does the cut scene have to show us? Use the skirmish formation to easily avoid and ignore Molotov cocktail effects. Okay, that's kind of cool. Over here, the news media channel rushes in Blowing dust out. A young lady, I think? Bringing the story to us. News van going back and forth all over the place. There go rolls in the friggin' police. Roll out, men. Shields up. There's no time for crap. Here comes the protesters. The angry rioters. What do we have to do? I don't even, I didn't even really look to see what we had to do. It looks like we got a bonfire over here or something, all right? We need to start remove the rioters. Okay. So all we have to do is remove the rioters. Well, all we have to do, something that we have to do is remove the rioters. Holy crap. They're beating the ever-living hell out of us for right now. Um, I'm trying to get everyone being aggressive. There we go. All right, men. Charge. Get rid of these scumbags. I want the arrow formation over here. Arrow formation. Snipe these people. There we go. That's how we do it. Charge! Charge is good for faking people out as well. 
But what I've seen is the arrow formation is really good for busting past, like, the defenses of the, uh, of the rioters. Seems to work pretty good. Push away the opposition. Alright, so it looks like we've begun pushing them away pretty good, actually. A little bit of a smoke bomb over here should do fairly well. Throw that smoke on down, baby. Let's go ahead and radio everyone over. Come on, police! Come on, police! Keep moving! Keep moving! We're just barely... It was. It's just barely on our side, but the rioters are starting to move us out. Go ahead and get the, ahead and get the police radio in. There we go. There we go. There we go. Smoke bomb. We don't have any armored cars or anything this time either, which makes me very, very sad. More smoke. Get some more smoke in here. And then let's let's go down here. Hold on. Go ahead and change to the arrow formation. And if we could do a charge. Here we go. Charge these people. Charge. Yeah, there we go. Move them out. Move them out, baby. We're starting to get some stones and stuff thrown at us. More smoke in here, I think, would be nice. There we go. Make a couple more sniper rifle shots. Look at this group down here. Look at this jet. Oh wow, the sniper rifle. Oh, okay, I thought it. I thought it was uh, replenishing like instantaneously. That would be a little bit too fast if it did. All right, fire another couple shots over here. Come on, fire, fire rifle. Fire rifle. Fire the rifle! Police, push in. Everyone push in. Let's get some charge orders out here, too. There we go. There we go. Couple of more smoke. Smoke chunks over here. Three minutes, 11 seconds. This is actually a long time we have to hold back over here. Uh, more smoke. More smoke. Oh, the police are freaking cowardly running away. Everyone keep pushing, man. Everyone keep friggin' pushing. More smoke! More smoke! I want more smoke in here. Get those smoke grenades out. Get these scumbags out of here. Start beating the crap out of people. Alright? Keep those radios moving too. There we go. The line is getting nice and far right now. Let's go ahead and get into our armored mode. Because that's gonna get some of these friggin' uh, some of these friggin' stones off of us. Another smoke grenade over here. And now I think it's a good time to fire a couple of shots. Keep moving back, suckers! Everyone freaking back up! Everyone freaking back up! Alright. Yeah. Okay. I think we're doing pretty good. We've managed to push them pretty hard, actually. Do I have one unit that's not angry right now? Hold on now. Everyone goes full angry today. Everyone goes full angry. I think I may even do some arrests or something here in a minute. Um, the only problem is... Is that our arresters? Yeah, you know what? Hold on, hold on. I got it, I got it. Let's, uh, let's arrest these guys that are behind our lines. Right here. Pull a couple of these guys out. There we go. Yeah, make some arrests. If you can. I don't even know if they can. Fire a couple more shots. Oh my god, they killed someone! We did it! We ended up slaughtering someone. I feel kind of bad about it. In a kind of pixelated way. Alright. Keep that radio going. Keep pushing our police up. And, um... Can we get some more arrests in over here? Look at all these, look at all this group over here, like right over here. Can we get some arrests in on this? Maybe? No? Maybe so? A couple of arrests? No, doesn't look like it. Alright, we pushed up basically like all the way. I'm gonna go ahead and throw a little bit of smoke in here, maybe to try and push these guys up this way. And then uh, a little bit of smoke over here as well. Here we go. And just kind of keep the discipline on right now for my police. Keep everyone pushed back, and yeah, man, that should be it. Uh, we can do a charge if we want. There we go. Just kind of knock some people down, push them on down over here into the smoke. Maybe we can clear them out. A little bit more smoke over here, just to keep this line as far over that way as humanly possible. And, uh, yeah, I think I'm gonna go ahead and lay down a couple more sniper shots, because why not? There we go. Now we just killed someone else. Just, uh... An average day over here in, uh, in the riot lands. Boys know how it is. Another rifle shot. There we go. There it is. All right. Now, that should be it, man. I think at, the, at this point, we have, uh, we have quelled the rioters. Uh, big time. Like, there's, like, one dude over here. We can go ahead and give him a beat. And then maybe arrest him or something. You guys arresting this guy or what? Get some arrests in. And look, I see them, like, I see the arrest thing kind of doing its thing every once in a while. But all right. Boom. We cleared the area, man. We cleared the area big time. 
Uh... They didn't stand a chance against the friggin' snipers. Oh my god. Wow, they, they wounded a lot of us. Every time I think that we are, like, super violent... Uh, somehow, the rebels managed to be pretty violent as well. So, maybe I was wrong about going the super violent route. Look at this. Only three rebels were wounded, but four of them were killed. 28 policemen were wounded. Like, all of my police officers were wounded. So, there's no advantage at all. The newspaper has to say, A riot turns into a war! As four die, an angry mob escape from police. Clashes between 20 policemen and 120 rioters in Greece ended with the most rioters on the run. The bloodbath caused four victims and 31 total injuries in 18 minutes after watching four innocent activists being killed. People are scared and furious about what happened. The shock seems to have affected many people outside the protest as well. We have unlocked Gezi Park Turkish Revolution. Syntagma Square. A new medium range grenade launcher. Journalist mode. Global mode. Global mode. What is global mode? I have no idea what that is. All I know is that we just beat some ass big time. Oh, what is this? Flag. Flying overhead. As the men depart from their construction site. A hard day of... Shooting people with sniper rifles. Some of which who may have been innocent. Good job, everyone. Many flags. Rolling overhead. And, oh, mother of God. This is bad. Yeah. And as the music begins to play, I guess that's it for Karatea. Let's go check out what the, uh, what those different modes are. Oh, wow. So this is global mode. You can pick all kinds of different things over here. Like, if you go back over here, it says, uh, press any button to join. I don't know if this is like a two-player thing or what, though. Like, if we click on this... Oh, you can choose whatever you want. You can choose all the different times and everything. Can you choose the weather, too? That'd be cool if you could choose the weather. Um, but there's still a lot more stories for us to go through. So I think what we'll do is we just did a lot of police work. Let's go back over to the story. We haven't messed around with Italy yet. Uh, and we haven't messed, let's see over here, we haven't messed with Egypt really either. So, we can do a little bit of this. Protest against crime and violence behind the regime. You know, let's go ahead and do this. We're gonna do a little bit of this real quick. It's gonna be the Friday of Anger, where we have to occupy. We're gonna be the angry mob one time over here, but just like before, we're gonna go full insanity. It's another beautiful day. As a vehicle burns in the background, <laughs> I was gonna say, as the sun rises. This guy, he's like, I give up! That's right, it's peaceful, police. It's peaceful. There's no- <laughs> In Egypt, the unemployment rate is high and poverty is increasing every day. Hmm. And then every once in a while, people get freaking shot in the street! Now I don't feel bad about going full violent, people. We're gonna be the mob. And we're gonna go full violent. Living- after living th for 30 years in a state of emergency, millions of crap. I think I may have, uh, I think I may have, like, pressed previous before that message came up, and now I don't get to see it. So we'll never know. I imagine they're- they're living in a state of annoyance, and now they're gonna go beat some ass. Let's find out what we have over here. The crowd diversion is pentagonal. Or division is pentagonal. Uh, and again, like before, how the more gear we have, oh my god, 1,200 people? We were dealing with hundreds before, and it's starting us with 1,200? Holy crap. Um, maybe I can get a couple more flags in on this. Let's see what other stuff we have over here. We've got the China Maltov. I want all Maltovs. Because the Maltovs, I found, are really good. I do want the Bullhorn as well, the megaphone over here. And then... Rocks, do I really care about that that much? Not really. Um, I'd rather have, like, more social media. If you double up on social media, can you use this twice, I wonder? I don't know. I'd rather just have the megaphone for right now. So, megaphone, the two different types of Molotov cocktails, because it's the most violent thing we have right now. And, uh, social media. So, let's go ahead and do it. This is a Friday of Anger. We've got over a thousand friggin' people participating in this. 
Let's do it. The better I get to know men, the more I find myself loving dogs. Okay. All right. It's January 25th, people, 2011. In comes the smoke grenades! Well, that, that guy just got friggin' beaten. No! No! Oh, I thought that guy was gonna get run over for a minute. Oh, we are getting pushed back. It's insanity and bedlam over here. Save the students from being moved away by the protest. All right, boys. Let's get full offensive. Full offensive mode. Remember, no survivors. Rebels must hold. All right. And there we go. That is a lot of police, man. Throw all the Molotovs down. Get the bullhorn in. Where are you boys going? The hell over here. Social media. Now, can you use social media when you're on angry, I wonder? I really don't know. See how the group always gets away from you, though? Look, it's, it's, like I said, it's like freaking herding cats. It's like trying to herd freaking cats. Get the bullhorn in over here. Let's, uh, more Molotovs. Molotovs for days. I want Molotovs everywhere. Molotovs, Molotovs, Molotovs. There we go. That megaphone in. Megaphones. There we go. A lot of our men, it looks like, have been driven away. Uh, look, see how we have, like, a bunch of guys over here? I kind of wonder if I need to get the megaphone closer to them to, like, draw them in. No, not really. Doesn't look like they're pressing that hard over here. Come on, boys. Don't you people get scared on me. A lot of our rioters have been completely driven off, it looks like. All right, more Molotovs. More Molotovs. Molotovs for days. More megaphones as well. Now, I kind of wonder if uh, if this is the position we have to hold over here. It kind of looks like it is. But I'm not 100% sure. Yeah, this has got to be our position. So I guess we have to just stay in here. I was, like, trying to push the police way back over here, but we don't need to do that at all. We just need to stay up in here. So our social media for everyone. Grab as much of it as we can. Yeah, it doesn't look like you can use it on aggressive mode. So I'm actually going to grab two units. I think on happy mode. Maybe? Oh, maybe it does work. I don't know. For some reason, I felt like it didn't. All right. We're doing good. Rebels are holding. The police are starting to line up, though. I don't like that. Hold on. Let's go ahead and throw down some Molotovs. Try and break up the police line. There we go. Yes. Yes. Good. Good. I like it. Yeah, see how it looks like and sometimes the uh, the social media is like not highlighted or something. I'm not really sure Continue to get more people in on this though. That's what I'll do I'll keep two people on just kind of passive and the rest on angry right now Just because I want to make absolutely certain that our social media is hundred percent working Although it doesn't really look like we're needing it right now. Look at how many people we've gotten here The police are way pushed back at the moment this random group over here doesn't seem to want to move. It could be who we're trying to protect. Not really 100% sure yet. More social media. Oh, here we go. Police are trying to make a run for it. Get those cocktails in. Yep, there we go. There we go. There we go. Break up there. Break. Oh, 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 oh. Up here. Up here. Up here. Up here. Up here. There we go. You can see them every once in a while. The police try and make these breaks for it. But we throw in our cocktails and we kind of like bust up their line. Which is working really good. All right. Looks like the police are lining up again. Screw this. I'm gonna go. I'm gonna go full angry again. Full angry. We're gonna go full angry for maximum Molotov cocktails. Like I said, it doesn't matter. If it doesn't. Oh, hold on. If it doesn't. Uh, if it doesn't work all the time, I'm not too worried about it. A couple of police look like they were trying to bust on in over there. All right. Throw some more cocktails down. There we go. At this point, the police are so far away. I don't even know if I need to cocktail them really. But, oh, 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 look at this. We got a charge coming in. We got a charge coming in. Charge coming in. Hold on. Back him up. Back him up. There we go. There we go. A couple of stonings. Oh, there comes the grenades. They totally missed. They totally missed us. The area was successfully occupied. We didn't even have a problem. That was fantastic. All right. Defenseless for the win. We had a couple of woundings. Uh, but really, we... Wow. Oh, we, we did execute some violent attacks. Okay. So it's an extreme advantage on the police side. So I was about to say, like, 
we didn't really wound that many police officers. Like, we wounded eight of them. Whereas when I was playing, they were wounding like 25 and stuff like that. But, uh, whatever. We didn't really do any property damage at this time. But, we got to be violent as hell. We got to use the friggin' water cannon. And we got to manipulate a mob of like a thousand people. This game is really sweet, man. We continue to unlock new stuff. I'm really enjoying it. Guys, what do you think? What should we do in our next play? Should we go like super cautious pacifist run? Or should we keep going with live ammo and full casualties? Feel free to let me know in the comment section below. Until the next time, folks, stay foxy and much love.